Hello again, I'm Rodney Reynolds from 3dgameman.com. Please remember to support us at support3gm.com. This next question is, is NVIDIA dying? I've gotten so many emails about this over the last little while. It's unbelievable. So what I've done is written a little article addressing this very topic. Here it goes. As most of you know, all talk these days is about NVIDIA discontinuing a number of high-end video card products, company mismanagement, reseller consumer relations issues, and much, much more. Is this really what's going on? Well, I myself emailed NVIDIA about this very topic with no reply. Now, this is nothing new. I've emailed NVIDIA in the past many, many times and have gotten no response. This, though, is not typically the case with most companies, at least not from my experience. Typically, when I email companies, most of them get back to me within hours, if not minutes. And let me tell you, I've sent out a lot of emails to companies over the years. Now, people have asked me, why don't I video review more NVIDIA products? Well, it's because I really can't get hold of anybody there. And when I do, I never really get a response back. So I guess I'm ignored. I know 3dgameman.com might not be one of the top three tech sites on the planet, but you'd expect a response of some sort. Don't get me wrong, I'd love to video review NVIDIA products. It's just that I really haven't had the opportunity to do so. If a company's policy is to burn bridges and treat people this way, well, I guess we all know where they are headed. This is very, very unfortunate because competition in the video card market is a good thing. I guess, though, on the bright side is if NVIDIA does slip into the abyss, another company will buy them out and fire a few CEOs, and they'll be afloat again. So NVIDIA, please find the time to get back to me, or at least respond to this video, as many, many, many people are wondering what is really going on. I hope this answers your question, and keep your questions coming.